American Girl's newest historical character, Nikki Hoffman, and some of her pieces from her collection. Oh my goodness. So, American Girl recently just released two new dolls, both from the 90s. They're twins, Isabel and Nikki Hoffman. Today we're going to be opening Nikki and all of her stuff from her collection, except for her pajamas. Listen, I ordered everything from her Ultimate Collection. Her pajamas are sadly on back order until March 17th. I really hope they get here before then, but it's okay if they don't. No worries. So, when they come in, I will be making a video on them. I plan on doing three videos over their collection. This one over Nikki, uh, one over Isabel's, and then another one opening some more pieces from their collection. So, I'll include that in that video. So, make sure that you're subscribed and following so then you don't miss out on those epic videos. So, if you like without further ado, let's get started! Sadly, the only outfit that we're going to be opening today in this video is Nikki's skateboarding outfit because, like I mentioned in the intro... Nikki's Ultimate Collection does come with her pajamas, but when I placed my order, apparently it was on back order, so it's not going to get here until March something, so, but it's okay. It's okay because, it's okay. I'm really excited for this one, though, because it looks pretty cool. It's a skateboarding outfit, like I mentioned, because of the skateboard, it looks like. I'm pumped for this. Ooh, girl, look at these goodies. Okay. So first, we have the skateboard. I think we should look at that first, because I really like it, and it's really neat, and it's really cool. Okay, so here it is. The top is like the black, is black, and then you have a little doll handle so you can put your doll's feet in it and make it look like the cheese or they're actually skateboarding, okay? On the bottom, you have, you know, your wheels, okay? And then it has its plaid design with purple, green, yellow, a blue and then you have some smiley faces some hearts some aliens like very 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 cute little skateboard and it can actually roll like ah! oh my goodness it's just so it's so cute I just love it okay next we have the shoes to the outfit these shoes are literally so cute oh my goodness so they're flats and they're this lovely burgundy color I feel like these would be like really cute to mix and match because they're like really cute little shoes like oh my goodness next we have her vest her vest is really cute I can see again I can see you can mix and match this as well so up at the top it's dark blue then you have a medium blue striped like a sky blue and then you have a yellow stripe and then at the bottom it's this burgundy pink color very very pretty it's sleeveless you don't have sleeves on it and then it doesn't zip it's just I don't know slide over vest and then we have the shirt okay the shirts very very cute if you ask me this lovely pink slash burgundy color um very very cute it's just a plain shirt velcros in the back short sleeve yeah you can do a whole lot with that like a mix and match okay and next we have her overalls these are so cute okay so these are long overalls you have you know you have the pants Okay, oh my goodness, these are like a lovely blue denim color of a clear American Girl tag. Here's the back if you're curious. This feels a lot thicker than Blair's overalls. If you collected American Girls 2018, no wait, 18 was Luciana. So 2019 was Blair's year. Uh, this is like a lot thicker quality than Blair's so this is like really good quality it's very thick absolutely love this the shirt uh going back to that shirt I mentioned earlier it's very thick as well it's not thin at all with the with the twins collections I've noticed a lot of things being just extraordinary quality so American Girl they did not come to play with the twins girl like oh my goodness Okay, and then you get a pamphlet in the set, which is the last thing. Uh, it says Nikki, 1999, 1999 on it. She's wearing her skateboarding outfit, obviously, because this is the outfit that we opened. She's on her skateboard, and she has a helmet and her knee pads on, and she's on her skating uh, skateboard rink thing, which is what American Girl sells as, a, as their big ticket item. So here she is again. Inside, uh, it's... Um, can you help Nikki match each skateboarding term to its meaning? So that's really fun. And then you, then it gives you the answers too to make sure you know that you're right and stuff. 
This outfit is really cute and really good quality. I'm impressed. I'm in love. Okay, so this is Isabelle's and Nikki's pet set. You get this in Isabelle's Ultimate Collection Bundle and in Nikki's Ultimate Collection Bundle. So let's see what their pets are. Have to offer. Let's see how cute they are. They're going to be so cute. Oh my goodness, you get two pets in this. You know, one for Nikki, one for Isabel. I'm so excited. I love pets. I love American Girl pets. Ooh! I think they're ready to come out. Oh my goodness. Okay, you ready? Ready? Oh, here's the cute little kitty. She's so cute. Or he's so cute. Oh my goodness. So, we have a kitty. Very, very cute. It's brown, light brown, and some dark brown, and some medium brown, some tan. But look at the cute, adorable face. Oh my goodness. It's very soft. Usually the historical pets and the Girl of the Year pets, they're not posable like the Truly Me pets are. So sadly, this kitty is not posable like the Truly Me kitties. But very soft little stuffed animal that I just absolutely love. Okay. And then I think we have we have one more pet that's that's getting ready to come out. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> Look! Oh! oh my goodness, so this is like a chocolate labradoodle puppy. Listen, I don't even know my pet breeds, so I apologize if this is not. It's a brown um puppy. He reminds me of chocolate chip. From if you guys are really old, well, not old, American Girl Collector, but uh, back in like 2012, maybe? Kind of in that time period, American Girl, uh, they had out a cute little puppy that, that literally looked like this, and his name was Chocolate Chip. I have him in the doll room, actually. Where is he? Where Where is he? Where What room is he in? I think, I can't remember where I put him, but he's somewhere in the doll room, vibing and living his best life. So, yeah, he looks like he could be, this puppy could be like siblings with chocolate chip from the old My American Girl line. Very, very cute. And then the last thing that you get in this pet set is a cute little pamphlet that says Nikki Isabel, well, it says Isabel Nikki in 1999 with Isabel and Nikki in uh with their beds kind of so Isabel's sitting on her bed wearing her pajamas with her cat her bedroom accessories and Nikki is by her bedroom accessories with her dog they're both wearing their pajamas like how cute opening it up it has Isabel and Nikki modeling their pajamas along with their pet sets in their journals and then it talks about how to draw a sleepy kitten a, a sleepy kitten my bad and a playful puppy Oh, that's really cute. I love that. Now we're going to be opening Nikki's accessories. I'm so excited about this because, spoiler alert, it comes with some Pleasant Company stuff. American Girl of Today. So, Pleasant Company was what American Girl was called before the name change. American Girl changed the name from Pleasant Company to American Girl in 2004. And then their Truly Me line, which is what it's called today, Truly Me. They used to be called American Girls of Today or American Girls Today back in the 90s. So, yeah, cute little American Girl history facts right there. Okay, so first up we have this really pretty light blue hat with the American Girl of Today logo on it. So that's really cute. Oh my goodness, you have buttons on it. Shut up. Okay, sorry. I'm so excited. Okay, so these are the mini grin pins. So this has... It's yellow, it has a red star on it, and then this is white, and it says play on it. So this is just a really cute little ball cap. Oh my goodness. Next, we have her bag. So this is a black leather shiny bag. It is very, very cute. It says skate club on it, and it zips open, so you can fit some stuff inside. Okay, next up, we're going to go to what I'm so excited about is the mini grin pins. Oh my goodness. Peel them off this card and stick them on your doll's vest. Okay, okay. So it sounds like from their collections, different things that they have, that they are American Girl Doll collectors. Uh-oh. Or I should say Pleasant Company collectors. Okay. So they come on this cute card, but the stuff can come off. Oh wait, no. 
What? Okay, so you have a little slot in here to, that holds the sheet of them together. Okay, so I got them in the uh, little thing. You know what I mean? So anyways, so it says mini grin pens. Peel them off this card and stick them on your dolls vest. So the pens are on a clear plastic thing, which can attach to this paper thing right here. You get good friend pen, a pizza, a blue... A pen with a purple star, a Miss H.E. Bear pen, a sunflower, oh my goodness, my dolls fell. Okay, update, they're both fine. So, yeah, they're good. <laughs> Alrighty, back to the video. I'm so sorry about that, guys. We have a sunflower, we have a red heart, so it kind of looks like a red slash pink heart. We have some math uh, equa equations, we have some puzzle pieces, then we have some stars and a smiley face, which is really cute. Okay, next thing is sunglasses. I'm excited about these sunglasses. So here they are. They're just black sunglasses. They're really cute. They're kind of shaped like a cat eye a little bit. That's what they look like to me. <laughs> okay, next we have her choker. I'm excited for this. Chokers were really big in the 90s, and I feel like they're even, like, big now still. You know what I mean? Here it is. It's just this black uh, choker with a cute little, oh, what's this called, symbol? It's like the white and black little alien thing? Is that really an alien? I don't really know what the symbol is, but, you know, it's iconic, so. Next we have Nikki's journal. It says Nikki 1999, and then in it, it looks like she has written, she's done some journal entries, which is really cute, and then with some illustrations, and then you have some big paper in it, so then you can record some of her journal entries in your doll room. Alrighty, here we are. We're gonna be opening Nikki. I'm so excited to open her. Oh my goodness. I just, I'm so excited. Can't you tell? <laughs> I'm like all over the place today. Okay, opening, taking the lid off the box. First thing that she comes with is her journal, which says Nikki, 1999, my journal. This is just like Isabel's and Kavi's journal. It's basically her story told in Nikki's perspective, and it's told in like her her journal like perspective so it is a bit different than past and regular American Girl books but I really like this I do know that they are getting a regular novel in August which is really exciting and I can't wait to read that as well she's a stunning queen that's all I have to say she's she's just stunning in the box I love her meat outfit I think it's really cute it's very different and unique and I like it here she is, officially out of the box. Oh my goodness, she is adorable. She's such a stunning queen. Here she is! I love her, guys. She's so pretty. Okay, so let's talk about her features. So first of all, she has these adorable, really pretty blue eyes. I kind of turned the brightness up so you can kind of see her blue eyes just a little bit more. So, yeah. Her face mold, I've seen people say she has the Joss face mold, see people say that she has a Marie Grace face mold. I see a mixture of both, so I'm thinking that she, that she's a Joss though. Thinking she's a Joss, so yeah, let me know if you guys think differently. But I'm seeing, I'm seeing a little bit more Joss, every time I say Joss, I see a little bit more Marie Grace, so I don't know, but she's really, really pretty no matter what face mold she has. Let's talk about her outfit. So her outfit is this cute little dress, okay, with a gray shirt underneath, which I think is attached to the dress. No, it's a separate shirt. Okay, so that's really interesting how they didn't make that attached, but they made Isabel's two shirts attached. So that's really interesting. So the, so the shirt is a gray shirt, and then you have this purple lining up at the collar and down at the arms on the sleeves. It's a short sleeve shirt. The dress is this beautiful dress, and it has this pink star on it. And then she has this cover-up, which I believe is just a long sleeve shirt, kind of wrapped around her. I'm not going to untie it because I really think that's a cute detail, and I kind of want to leave her in that for right now. And then she has some socks. They're white socks with the same color purple up at the top. These socks are just kind of just go past her, like, mid-calves or something like that. I don't know. I'm not really good with body parts, so... 
you know, there's that, but they're not knee socks. And then she has these cute little blue kind of platform tennis shoes, which they're not really platforms, but you know, they're a little bit more dramatic than a normal tennis shoe. But yeah, she's really, really pretty. I love her so much. I think we're ready to take the hairnet off. Ooh, girl. Okay. She is, she's, she's really pretty. Okay. First of all, oh my gosh. Okay. I'm trying to like, I need to, I probably need to brush her hair. Because her hair is kind of, I need to brush her hair for sure. But this is kind of what she looks like with out of the box hair a bit. So first of all, her hair is mostly this brown color. But then she has blonde streaks up at the front of her hair. So yeah, I'm pretty sure that was a big trend in the 90s. But then it was coming back too. Is it still back? I don't even know, but her hair is really long. It's much longer than Isabel's. It kind of goes to her, like, hips because it's very, very long. She's such a pretty doll. Oh, my goodness. She is stunning. So, guys, please welcome Nikki Hoffman to the Dollies and Rainbows family. Alrighty, guys, so that was opening almost everything in Nikki's Ultimate Collection. I apologize that her pajamas are on back order, even though it's not my fault um, that they're on back order, but I feel like it's my fault that they're on back order. I don't know. I'm one of those girls. Anyways, I'm really excited to have her and her twin, Isabel, a part of my doll collection and my doll family, and I just, I'm just so obsessed with both of them. Like, I cannot describe my love towards these two dolls. I really think American Girl did such a good job with them. I think Nikki is such a good quality doll. She, her meat outfit's amazing. Everything in her collection that we opened today was amazing. I, I love it. I love it. I think it's such a good collection, good quality, and it's cute. Like, yes, queen. Like, I just love it. Be sure to go check out the video I did over Isabel's Ultimate Collection, uh, because that video is just as amazing, just as awesome. Her collection is just as awesome and epic as Nikki's and yeah I really recommend Nikki's collection I think it's really cute I can't wait to get more of their items like their pizza hut book it set their computer their bedroom accessories like oh my goodness and I can't wait to see more of their collection in person when I go to American Girl Nashville on March 12th so if you're in the area that day I'd really love it we met if we could meet up I love meeting new people who just love dolls just as much as I do and I just think it's really fun getting to meet other doll collectors and so thanks for watching this video, everyone. I hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on my Instagram if you haven't so if you haven't done so already. <laughs> Same name, Dollies and Rainbows. Check me out on TikTok. Ta oh. Check me out on TikTok as well. Oh my goodness, I can't. Like, jeez, I'm having, I'm struggling today. Same name, Dollies and Rainbows on TikTok, Instagram, YouTube. Also, be sure to go check out my Doll Mom podcast. I just posted a new episode yesterday, February 25th. Oh my goodness. It's it's amazing. It's episode 16. I have on one of my best doll friends. My best friend is on it. So make sure that you go listen to it on your favorite podcast listening platform. We talk about travel tips for your dolls and doll news. It's just such a fantastic episode. So make sure that you go check it out. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Comment down below what's your favorite thing from Nikki's collection and Isabel's collection, what you like about the twinge, uh, what you want to get in your collection, what did you buy for your collection, anything. Just get the conversation going down below if you're able to, of course. And yeah, I think, I think that's it. I'll see you next time. Bye!